Browns Hall of Fame left tackle Joe Thomas um, was on the Rich Eisen show, was asked about the Browns' chances of winning the AFC North. They're going to have a hard time keeping up with the Ravens without Deshaun Watson playing good football at quarterback because Lamar Jackson's probably playing his best football right now. Right. And that's a complete team. Uh, I thought the Lions were the most balanced team in the NFL. I thought that they were a team that would be able to con con uh keep up with the Philadelphia Eagles because they played a physical style because they've got great offensive and defensive lines. Uh, but the way the Ravens just handle them, I'm a little nervous for my Brownies because this Ravens team is legit and they might be the most balanced team now in the NFL outside of the Philadelphia Eagles. Yeah, the Ravens did look good, but again, uh, let's see, can they do it a couple weeks in a row? Yeah, the, the Ravens are just well coached. I think that's what that comes down to. So they're they're going to be a tough out week in and week out. Some weeks they don't play as well. But when Lamar is firing, they're almost unbeatable just because if he's efficient throwing the ball and given on top of that what he already does with his legs, that's going to, it's going to be a tough ask to do week in and week out. Uh, but they are beatable. That is a team that is beatable. No one's really running away with this division. The Browns need to capitalize on these games that should be wins on their schedule. And I know they're under underdogs this week, but it's slight. And if Watson was full, fully healthy, I'm not sure they would even be underdogs on the road in Seattle. That's how highly I think of this roster. So I, I think that they can stay within striking distance over these next four games. Then hopefully Watson can come back and get to form and the Browns can actually compete for the AFC North this season. Yeah, the, the, uh, the North has been – everybody's 500 or better. Um, and, and, you know, we talked about them beating each other up. If you look at it, Every team in the AFC North is on a two-game winning streak. That's, they're kind of proving how good this division is. Yeah, and it started off a little rougher, and we're like, oh, maybe this isn't the division that we thought it was, and here we go. Now we're starting to see it, and it's a very physical division. This is, this is a team where physicality wins out. Baltimore's physical, Pittsburgh's physical, Cincinnati's physical on defense. Uh, there's some tough matchups coming up ahead for some of these other teams. The Browns have one of the more favorable schedules, so they just need to take advantage of it now and start to creep up those standings.